We've always grown up and known women with makeup and them something there, yeah. enhancements and Wonder Bra and one. Remember Wonder Bra? You, you, Can I say something to you? High sock titty, them you know. See Wonder Bra, it's magnificent, up. you know. Wonder Bra. Because, but now when you see you with a woman, you have to wonder what kind of titty she have. Wonder <laughs> what? No, not a Wonder Bra. Like a Wonder Wah. Go on. In the one, forget Wonder Bra. Just call Wonder Wah. Check, check. Back in the building. It was the lady with the check, check, you know? Yeah, my check. Right, take it. A- check, check. Back in the building. Your boy C6. Your boy, did uh, Did you clean the camera lens, though? Because last week I was looking fresh and fly. Yeah, yeah. Don't... Yeah, that was... that. Was, I did it on purpose last week just to show you what you can look like. That was... I'd I done a little air, airbrush and all of them thing there as well. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, sometimes you look a bit scabby and squapsy. So, you know, the airbrush it and that, that was a bit of, um, you know what I mean, Photoshop business. But yeah, we're here, man. Another episode, Elephant in the Room podcast. Big up the full family. Big oh, up all of our patrons. Up, come on, big up everybody. Yeah, you know? you're feeling a bad man mood. Come on, big up everybody we support with, is it? Yeah, big man. All of the subscribers, them. All of my the, turn now. All of the YouTubers, them. You're all of the Patreon family, them. Everybody upon Spotify, Apple. Oh, God, I got a bone anyway, to pick go with you as well, please. Piece of shit. Um, because even they said it in the comments. Mm. I remember you said you're gonna have the names. <laughs> I promise you. See this week here. Yeah? No, no. Can no, no, land? You, can I land? No, no. Let me. I'm, I'm still circling. The, the, the wheels are coming down. I still got more. You understand? Yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> so, you have said that it's gonna come on. It's gonna be the screen. Fuck all came. You said it's gonna come off because the screen. Fuck all came. You said you're gonna show the piece where I said I was gonna pay. So I knew I'd never said it because you never had it to give. It. So yeah. that's cleared. You say things on this podcast now. <laughs> you turn it to me. I said Uno reverse, yeah? You turn it to me. Uno reverse. I promise you, you this week. I this promise. Week, Ross, all I'm gonna do. you. No promise. <laughs> Down. Stop it. Stay away from the word promise. <laughs> I'm going to stay away from the word promise. I'm going to try and remember to have patron names flying across the screen all episode. Just on the bottom. No, don't do that. Now I'm going to big them up constantly throughout the whole thing. Patrons, big them up. Be a part of the Patreon family. There's a lot of them, so their names. I'm gonna do my best to just have them floating along the screen. Yeah. Oh fucking hell! I'm gonna Sorry, do my I best. To I'm gonna do my best. Out. I'm gonna do my best. Because I don't best. want to swear, but you just brought out the the curse in I'm me. I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna do my best. I honestly forgot to be honest. It's only when I when I saw the first comment, I said, "Kiss my neck." I forgot. It's when I saw the comment, I thought, "Yes, this piece of shit." No, no, I didn't forget. It's when I saw that I was waiting for the piece to come. I was watching it, and there was nothing there. The evidence is even there. Imagine that. Imagine that. <laughs> Sorry, the evidence is there. You, there was. You I said had, I had the prime. It, I had the prime. Ex- and here you see you done now. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Nothing. Not, nothing. 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 And nothing. Ne- means nothing. Idiot. Trust me. I feel, yeah, I feel like an idiot. But let's say it go. And you, you're cutting yourself. I can't even cut you. I feel like you, an idiot. I feel like it, when you when you're you, supposed to when you read the comments here, yeah, but like and and they point out something that. We should have done mm-hmm. what we said we're gonna do, or just something basic, something that we that's fully in your control. Uh-huh. You feel like an idiot when they comment Good. about foolishness, then it's like, oh, whatever, you're just making it up. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But when they comment on things that you know was in your power and in your control, and you let it go, yes, jolting. So yeah. So. Now, um, see, the last video I did, you see about the man weave. I'm, I'm actually s- the dread, the dread, the dread. It's mad, though, isn't it? Yeah, it's mad. I just feel like um, people should just. Let it go. Scroll gracefully, man. No. I'm serious. I, f- uh, no. I feel that way. No, because that's like saying the women just, we're well, natural hair. They're, not, they're never going to hear that. It's not about the women. It's like. It's about, to it's be about a everybody. Man, to be a man, I feel like. But God's child. There's a, there's a <laughs> <laughs> I think there's, I think my my interpretation of what a, a man should be, shouldn't, shouldn't be doing cosmetics and dyeing his hair and putting on man pieces and all them <laughs> foolishness. That's not my interpretation of what a man should grow into be so I can't I can't see that and want that for myself, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Anyway, so you're gonna do it. Dread you're, up. One day you're just gonna yeah. Gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try and I'm gonna get the dread one because I've so always like wanted to dread. One episode we're gonna just see, see a you dread a bit. <laughs> yeah. yeah, man. I agree. Can I say something to you? Anybody watching who knows where to get them headpiece from and can pull it on? Come, my barber just knows how to cut hair. He doesn't really know. 
how to glue on and put on that shit. So anybody that's out there that does it for certain man, that man will think like certain man's got hair and them time they've got one of those because yeah, yeah. they look good. So if More anybody... Than, you would like, so you'd, and that's it, you'd rock it proper. But I'd rock it proper. All right, so people, please, listen, this is a, um, an appeal. Yeah, if public you know service any, announcement. Yeah, public service announcement. This is an appeal. We, you know, this is, we want to get Dizzle Dreads. We want to get Dizzle Dreads and he knows that it's a cheating situation. He's going to cheat his way to Dreads. He's going to have no dreads today and full dreads So tomorrow. when a woman has weave on today, she's cheating her way through life. Eyelashes. I, li- Lipstick. Course, oh, listen, uh, to be honest here, yeah, I don't think... False breasts. Hold on, but you see the difference. False batty. Yeah, when all of that stuff is cheating. False you know, nails. False cheating, but... False identity. <laughs> We've always grown up and known women with makeup and them something there. Yeah. Enhancements and wonder bra. And one, remember, wonder bra. You, you, Can I say something to you? High sock titty them, you know. See, wonder bra is magnificent, them. you know. Wonder bra. Because we... Cause but now, when you see it with a woman, you have to wonder what kind of titty she have. <laughs> wonder what? No, not a wonder bra. Like, I wonder why I go on. In the one, forget wonder bra, just go wonder why. <laughs> wonder why I go on around Dessa. Yeah, yeah with the wonder why I go on. <laughs> yeah. 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 Man, about the wonder why. <laughs> and not the wonder bra. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, so, I, that's what I'm saying, growing up, you, you know that there's always an enhancement for women. So, but men enhancements are mad to me. It's mad to me. Why? It's just mad to me. I'm not like a metrosexual. You know, these new age men. That's just, I'm not that. So, so you don't People like say to me, yo, why don't dye your beard? I say, because yeah, I don't want to. I'm, de- I'm dead. It's going grey. And I'm just going to go grey with it. No, but you don't look it. No, but it's grey, bro. Yeah, but it's, so dye it. I, I swear if you dye, you, you, you knock off 11 layers. <laughs> 11 teen. You yeah, knock off 11 I'm teen not years. I'm dying my beard, bro. I'm not dying it. I'm in a business. Who don't like That's it? That's what I'm saying. I'm so, it. so. You don't go for facials and that. Why for that? But you don't no, go. I for don't do none of them something there. Pedicure them. Don't do none of them something there. Don't do none of them something there. Not do none That's the new age man. Man don't yeah, call it facials. Not, but I'm still, man said it's called male grooming. Yeah, but I'm still the old school male. So that you don't do male grooming. grooming. Mm-mm. You get a haircut, go barbers. You're dead. <laughs> well, I hope no. I hope not. Fucking. Like no, I, I don't. I don't do that. I love all that shit. Yeah, because you're a bitch. No, can I say something to you? You're, you, but you I've been that grew way. up. In the in in the battlefield, in the trenches, you understand? That's all I know. So coming to this new life and seeing like like even going out to a restaurant and eating, and that's amazing to me. Yeah. <laughs> it's amazing. So you go and get your nails, your, your pedicure, every pussy teeth. Well, so, hey, when I hey, facial. I on holiday and that, that I remember one time we was doing the podcast. You said I can't do the podcast. This was you know in, in chalk and cheese. Can't do the podcast. And then anyway, this all posted is getting this steam thing. Yeah, on my face. Yeah. Is, Ah, oh, hey, everybody, vaccina. What, man? Man didn't turn up to the pod to go and get facial. But I think if it was gifted, I might have done the same thing. But yeah, no, nah, it's, it really, it's not really for me. It's not really for me. Why? You, you should try really it. It's not really, I'm not on it. It's not, I'm not on it. But I'm not rough, So you though. don't go... Pe- did you, I'm not rough, you do, you do pedicures and no, get your feet I've done? I've never had none of them something there. But Are I'm you? not rough, though. I'm not rough. Like, I'm not rough. You know, like... My, I'm not rough. You know, some man rough and you need that. You know, like I don't have no tough skin on my foot. None, I'm not rough at all. Can I say something? So there's you? nothing that I, I feel like I'm missing out on. I don't, I'm not rough. If you, when you're rough and scaly, scaly, you might need the little chop backs and the, the cut, you cut away. I'm not on none of that. I remember when I told my Bridget's house, yeah, and they had done some sliders, yeah. <laughs> and first things first, these feet, you know, when your feet hanging out the sliders. Madness claws, yeah, gripping. It was hanging out the yeah, sliders, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then his toenails look like he hasn't had them done since he was born. And he said he wears a couple sizes too big on his trainers because of his toenails. Trust me. And then when they're talking about he wants girl, <laughs> cut up her legs in the bed and that. <laughs> Whose sheets are you? Cut? Who's pop the sheets? There? Trust me. Yeah. No, his feet. Like men, certain men like the old school men, they don't take care of themselves, brother. Yeah. Now I cut my toenail, but I do it myself. Yeah, that's. To be honest, I cut my to- I used to cut my toenails so bad, you know, that one day I gave one time I gave myself an ingrown toenail. Oh, for fuck's Blood, sake. I had to go to the, the foot doctor, yeah? Yeah. And get and they How could you cut your toes so bad? No, because basically I cut my toenail to see blood. No, but well, then that's <laughs> bad, isn't it? Clearly. No, but you know what it is? If you cut your toenails like round, yeah. when they grow back sometimes they can grow inside the skin. So you've got to cut them. You gotta work with your toe. So whatever shape your toe is, and then it's also about how we walk. Some how you walk is how it f- affects how your your feet react. It's how some people get bunions and some people get corns and so mm-hmm. based on how your your foot stay. I didn't realize, but yeah, I cut my toenails, my big toe, so bad 
when it was growing back, it was in growing. It was growing within the skin. The worst pain ever, bro. Worst pain. And then they when they cut when they um did the um the little surgery, I had to go private. I was waiting and I went to the doctors. Doctor said, yeah, yeah, no problem. Like we're gonna refer you to the shop for this. Telling me for six weeks. I just go private and do it. And they've done it the same day. Chop it out. So then I realized, okay, cool, you gotta take care of it. But apparently the people that do the pedicure, they don't they don't take care of your your they don't do it the way of your feet. They do it a standard way. So some people go there, get their toenails clipped or whatever, and then end up with ingrown toenails. That's some fucked up toenails. But my thing is, yeah. This turned up. Yeah, my thing is I'm turn up this shit. Boom, boom, boom. Oh okay, yeah, this is my shit. Your yeah, so my th- my thing is, yeah. Why does that, like back in the day, man just is like scared? That's their like Achilles heel, sliders and socks. No, man didn't want to show their feet. No, I think I think man scared to show their feet. Lot, even now, there's I don't know what it is with people on showing feet. Some people have a proper like phobia with feet. But the most of the, I like, road man, I'm road not man wearing, especially, I'm not wearing sliders and socks. Roadman, even on holiday, I've seen it. But I was, in other, I was in t- Turkey the other week, yeah, last week, and the people them, it, there's people like on the beach, sliders and socks, and you know, me, I take a dip, me, 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 I walk out of the sea, socks on, man, running a swimming pool, socks on. I, I'm saying, what's going on here? What is going on here? Why is everyone like no, that? No, but it's, it's it's a serious thing to be. We're running a joke about it, but it's it's a serious like it's something inside. Man, don't really want to. Sh- yeah, but know. when they're with a the girl, they, they take off their socks. You understand? Maybe. To be fair, maybe if they if they they maybe they they might be like socks bandits. I remember one time I had one girl, yeah, back in the days, and she would never. I, I noticed that she's never taken off her socks. Yeah, I know a girl that's never taken. Never taking the first socks, you know? Never taking the first socks. And one time, she's like, she was like in front of me, and then she had, she had on like the, them, you know, them, them socks, and it shows the, the back of the heel. Oh, God. See you later, alligator. This <laughs> <laughs> is scaly, scaly. In a wild crocodile. Oh, shit. Yeah, nah. I know a girl that, I know a girl that used to always have. Gaily. Jurassic Park. It's mad, isn't it? Mad thing. See when I saw that? That's when I everything came together. Was it was that, like, yeah, it was like a, a p- epiphany. Yeah. Okay, so that's why you want to take off your socks. If the heel backs like that, then the heel, the front is worse. the front is a mental so, thing. So you, so you didn't mind after seeing that you was like, yeah, 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 on. yeah, we was good. Keep them on. Keep them on. Yeah, in fact, let me buy some football socks. No, first of all, the post football boots <laughs> or some Dr. Martins. We could do this. I said DMs, <laughs> DMs, Chelsea boots. DM me in your yeah, DMs. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, there's a, there's a lot of people that have. Issues with their feet and showing their feet and like men especially though yeah but enough man don't want to show their feet think, in public I think, I think feet has become too much of a thing in people's mind so like they some people like can't stand their feet can't stand feet and then other people like love feet and perv over feet and I just think feet are just there to walk on like just leave them alone don't even think about them sexually don't think about them in a in a don't romanticize feet they're just feet you know what I'm saying I know there's some people in no feet tell me on. that are gonna be a bit pissed off with me, but I think that's wild to me. No, I love feet. Like you find them sexy. Sexy. If I if I meet a girl, I'm slightly looking at the feet. If the feet is dead to me, if a girl's got really nice feet, you sucking off her toes. And no, I'm not sucking off no toes. So you don't. You're not a foot man. Too like much. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> do you mean just a little piece? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna suck it. I'm just gonna give it a kiss at all. I'm gonna lick it a little piece, but I'm not gonna really suck it. But <laughs> I lick it. I just give it a couple of licks. <laughs> yeah, loud the foot, man. Loud the foot. foot, man. The foot thing is mad to me. <laughs> it's mad to me. Like what? What is it? Like it's weird. It's just it's weird. No, can you fuck some girl with some? Sorry, should I say that? You have slept with some girls with some hammer time. I'm talking about let's do this, Bob the Builder. You understand? Them type of foot. Brother. So, so you've got a. Foot. But you're a foot fetish. No, guy. but you got a foot. You're short, a guy, you got you got go, got you got fancy the girl, and you, because you got nice feet, you're into her. You, yeah, you're but, one of them guys who be in the dance looking down. You see what? You, you see what? Yeah. Uh, let me tell you. You know what got to be that? The friends tips. When you got nice feet, I'm from. Oh God, you got my soul. <laughs> Forget my heart. Yeah. <laughs> I'm yours. I'm yours. Married at first sight. Yeah. Forget 
So me. like, so are you like? No, are you, I, let me are tell you. you I, subscribe to a foot only. No, no, that's not dead. No, I'm not that. I'm not got a foot fetish. But I don't know why foot turned me on. Is if so you got a foot fetish? No, like if a girl come to me, she got on her socks. I, I don't have sex with you. You could be naked. You're naked, but you got socks on. To me, that is wild. So <laughs> for you, so if the girl was fully clothed and then had, <laughs> had her socks on, off, then you'd be still turned on. You're if a freak, what? man. If she had fully clothed but had her socks off, kinda. <laughs> you're a freak, blood. No, weird, but my bro. thing, I like. I don't know. I just, to me, the foot is the soul of the essence. I don't do the face. Don't do that face. The soul no, of the essence. <laughs> the soul of the essence. <laughs> the, the foot is the soul of the essence. What the fuck is that? No, but. I'm being honest. I'd be like, I could have sex with someone. You get me? And then, rare, rare, and then I look and see the, the feet. Just looking so, it has to be a certain way and a certain angle as well. Not like crunch up. It gets you. Do you have it like, you know, like, you know, like, uh, yeah. I, I, listen. Guess to me. I, I, that's, my, that's my kryptonite I right there. A, I see a man they have in, in, say to a woman, yeah, hey, listen, just saying, no pervy thing. You got the nicest feet I've ever seen. <laughs> That's straight away you're perfect straight away you're perfect and I'm look, and I'm sitting like I'm sitting and I'm hearing him like kind of say it and I'm thinking you're perv yeah you're perv that's per like you mean it in the perviest way yeah like, just do your thing man just, just walk up and down like, you're, yeah. you're perv because yeah, you're, you you find them sexually attractive yeah and you just you couldn't help yourself you've been staring at them the whole time yeah you, yeah it's it's mad it's mad, and I even know. Anyway, I better not talk about this because we'll talk about it. We're close. here. It's a bit, cl- bit close. No, we're here. We're there. We're here. I we're know here. you. Go on. Years and years and years ago, <coughs> that done a crime on a woman. <coughs> Wait, that's and, not and, funny. And, and no, and, and mess with her feet, and as a crime, like you, you know, mean. Read between the lines, man. He done a crime on a woman, and messed with her feet as as opposed to messing with every anywhere else. And I, like they're mad to me, mad to me. Read between the lines. I'm not gonna talk the things too much, but yeah, mad to me. No, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah for the viewers out there, that's the viewers understand. <laughs> no, no, don't don't, understand. don't, don't, you, don't guess like them. You don't understand. Don't, you don't, don't guess understand. They know everyone's thinking this. Don't you get it? Yeah, man, attack a woman and fast with her foot, and that's it. That's mad to me. It's mad to me. We, we, we and I'm talking teenager times, so that's the man mad. grape the foot. <laughs> Don't use the, you can't see. This is what I'm saying. I'm gonna have to bleep that shit out. Yeah. Grape. I said he grape the foot. Anyway, yeah, something so, something so, mad thing. Anyway, let's move on. But yeah, that's that's what them things is weird to me because it's 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 like. But you know that people I, find it. Some people find it so sexually attractive, but it's something that we don't we don't hide. So you know you don't walk around with your breast out or whatever. So the things that we find sexually attractive are usually covered up. But if it's your foot or if you got a fetish about something like hands, them things are out all the time. So you'd be sit in the summer. You're sitting on the bus, perving. Yeah, that's mad to me. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, when you deep it like it's that, not hidden. Yeah. If you got a thing about kneecaps in the summer, you're you're creaming. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you get that? I'm getting park. I'm sitting in the park in the kneecaps, creaming. Yeah, that is mad to yeah, me. Yeah, brother. But. Feet is a nice part of, of a woman. Women with nice feet. Well, you're nice and you've got ni- nice feet and they're in proportion and no corn toe. You get me? So so if a woman's really nice, attractive, got a lot going for her, like there's a lot going for her and you know, she just ticks all your boxes but she got a little bunion and a corn. You say like, would it, could that tip, could that take it the other side? Could it throw you off? Well, I would have been 100% now I'm like 75. A whole 25% on that? It's a lot of percentage on on foot. That yeah. means you foot's high in your estimation. Yeah. What about oh, if well, I'm not gonna. What about I'm, if she's, what about I'm, if she, I'm gonna deal with you still. What about if she's dog shit, but she but she. I'm got, gonna deal with you. No, but because <coughs> I say something to you. If she's what? But she's dog shit. You know, like she look good, but she's you know, like fucked up, man. It's not forget all that. My thing is, if I'm taking you out, remember every man does it. I I I, I remember one time at my bridge and I said, look, man, look at this t- new thing I got. He sent me about the picture with. Uh, Zoomed in of her toes, hanging off the shoes. I think off of just yeah, you whatever shower she looked didn't. It was just, it, didn't, it didn't even matter again because that just threw you. That off. just threw everything off. I, when you got people yeah. if your shoes, your feet, it's that's that's important to men. So I don't know what women might have their little ick, but men, that's our ick. Your yeah. toes supposed to be yeah. on the I shoes. Don't, I don't like how I, some, I don't like you should, the, the worst thing it, when it comes to stuff like that for me 
I don't like girls who can't walk in their heels. Don't just don't wear them. Take yeah. them off. I'm yeah. alright with yeah. that. I'm not one. That, I'm not scornful. Like yeah. if I, I'm not, you know, some man see a woman in a dance with someone that's not heels, he gets upset. I'm yeah. not. A, I'm not negative about that. But you see, if you're doing mm. the Bambi walk, I can't stand that shit. Yeah, I can't stand that. Like allow it. Them things bug me. But that's more about you. Just the way you carry. That's you carrying yourself a certain way. It's not so much about your feet. It's about mm-hmm. the way you're carrying yourself. Yeah. And, and I don't like drunk up woman. Them things that annoy me. I'm yeah. talking. I don't mind drink your drink in it. But if you start doing too much. Yeah, and I don't really like do you like drunken women. I just said I don't like drunken women, bro. What's wrong with you? Sorry, because just just, just hear someone come in the building that threw me off. I just thought you was cussing about <laughs> something. The same. Anyway, cool. Let's move on. Yeah. Anyway, dilemma time. It's not dilemma time. I got things to talk about. All right, talk, current. Talk this is because this is an every week okay, show. Okay, targeting so them. So I won't. I want it to get stale. Targeting them. The leak audio of Burner Boy and P Diddy. Is it real? It's real. Is it, I saw for, something for, 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 for pod parts, um purposes. It's real, hundred percent real. I saw, <laughs> it's, off, it's authentic. What I saw, yeah, is they put them out in Africa and everything, you know. But what I saw is someone what? made like no a, pun intended. Like, <laughs> someone saw they made like a vid, like a fake picture in it of him in front of Diddy, and so then I felt like that totally discredited. Everything. No, because that's everybody's getting a bit too far. But that's what I'm saying. There's so, old footage and things, and the Grammy is. So wait, tell me what. Tell me because I haven't actually heard any leak. Footage. I haven't, oh, I haven't I, heard anything. So what? What is it? Like they're in a like both of them in a compromising situation. Is that me? Like someone's at the door and could hear them in the room. Not filming. Just just some audio. You get me? So you could hear like like with the meat meal one. So yeah, you could do hear. You not think that this could be AI. No, that one was AI. You think this AI would have went like different? One. That, that is this is we said this is real yeah and then remember you got the real footage of them like when burn a boy see him jumping out of the car when pd said yeah me and my boy burn a boy working on his album burn a boy co- contact me man like you're trying to reach out like burn a boy is trying to you know so now you're going to social media read between the lines do you think a lot of people are reaching though you know like because Cause i say something what to i don't want to do is i don't want to be like i can i did he's out of here innit? Diddy's out of it. Diddy's off key. He's out of it. But I feel like. But it wasn't just Diddy. That's the point. Bring down everybody. No, but that's, that's what I'm trying to say to you. It's, it wasn't just them parties, them free cross. Yeah. Where if you're somebody in the in in that in, to get an invite to the free cross, you know, you gotta be a free. Oh no, you got you want to be there. Remember but, but everybody, every that, top so. person you could think of. The, yeah, but Obama's how, been how, there. So how? So you say the Obama got? No, I don't know. Remember, remember, no. Him, they won't. He was not into that. That's what I'm saying. So remember, you got to remember. There's enough celebrities there, you know, and they're the freak. Remember, everybody's normal, you know. So the freak of done starts at a certain time. So, yeah, there's a party. There's a then the after party, and there's the after party after the after party. That's where it, it's about fifteen of them. You know the way there, and then it's some. That's where it, it goes down. You know what I'm saying? But you have to be of a certain caliber to be in that fifteen. You catch it. And do you think that this is all for gain, or do you think it's because this Remember is what they want? But you, you, because you, you don't get it because you're not way inclined in the sense of you're not fame hungry. You're not. You don't care about like all that designer clothes business. You just you, you don't, can't fathom that people would sell their bottom to wear like a, a pair of Louis shoes. I'm telling you, and their batty are them. So they're quite posh, isn't it? Yeah, their batty is banned. I can't, I can't, I can't fathom that. Real, I can't, I can't oh. see why you would. People would compromise their integrity for money, especially that's if you minor. No, but especially if you don't have it. Like that's the minor. Thing is, the thing is, listen. If you're if you've got money, yeah, you've got money because all of these people have money already. They just want more money. Yeah. So I don't know why you think why you compromise yourself to want what just a little bit more than what you already have. You already have you already have abundance. Mm-hmm. You see, what I'm you're not destitute. So why are we doing this? I don't want to feed my fame hungry. Remember, um, Diddy couldn't get certain people if they didn't want fame. R. Kelly, all these people, Weinstein, all these top people couldn't get where they want today without, you promise get what I'm dealing with? The, the promise of something. Yeah, so and these guys abuse their power. Remember, it's like a per big man and, you got, and, and you're in the office and you've got two looking nice, looking young girl coming in while, you get me? 
Yeah. And you know, you, can, you, you yeah. got power. They, you can see how, how bad you really want this. Yeah. You, it's abuse of power yeah. to the fullest of the fullest extreme. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is, man. I do know that. I do, you know, I'm not, I don't, I'm not saying that I don't get that it happens. I just don't get why people do it. You see what I'm saying? I, I know mm. if, if, if a, a guy that's, so a woman finds completely unattractive and doesn't like his personality, pulls up in a, in a flipping Bugatti, steps out, buys out the bar, just act, throws money up and down. He's going to end up with a woman in that club that's like like what's considered top tier, isn't it? But you, you, and, and, and that's based on what he's got and not who he is. No, but my so thing, I do know them things exist. I just don't get it, though. No, what I don't get is, remember, it's normal people with status. And you have, back in the days, even now, families dropping off, Usher's family, just to be dropping it off to these men for fame. Yes. Oh, oh Kelly wants to. Go, just make sure you go. And your cousin, the picnic, them, it's like, no, it's going to be all right. Yeah. Just sending, sending them off. To, sending you off. Sending you off. Because the, 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 the parents are failed at whatever they do mm. or did. Or tried. Clearly. To. You understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. For you to be in that desperate position to, set to, to pimp your child. You're pimping your child. You're pimping your child and you're trying to put on them blinkers to, to say like nothing yeah. happens. Yeah, because you, you, you're looking at the, the, the end goal. Yeah. So this is all part of the process. Yeah. Jolting. You understand what I'm saying? You're turning a blind eye. Some, and you, you secretly want that big man to deal with your daughter so you could be in like that. You know the mad way of thinking? Mad you're giving away your point. Like, yes, let's give him peace. Yes, <laughs> ma- yes. I'll kill you. They were my daughter. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, Gassed about it. Bragging rights or something. Yeah, them times your daughter's 14. It's mad to me. You touch what I'm dealing with. But it's crazy. That's how people are caught up in the celeb that, world. I got, we got to get out of that. You see that that materialism is it, it's crazy. Obviously, we all need and we, we want stuff and money. And Perfect. Let me give you a worse example. Get out of that shit, man. Look at it. And you saw it was real because I saw some shit blood. No, no pun intended. With the pot of poo gal and went to Dubai. Yeah, oh. They was getting big money, but they they didn't. That's what I'm saying. Do you think they care about integrity? Do you think any? They was while the man that was doo dooing on them, yeah. <laughs> Their face, mouth. mouth. I didn't yes. see that. I was I was proper like. You, you catch it? Why, 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 what does it's not like no one told us. What does the man get it's, out of that? No, you know what it is. You see, when you got so much money and you just. You explicit abuse of power. I've got so much money. Let me see what these gal will do for money. You know what? It's like a joke. Let me see. I bet it, I got so much money. I bet I could pay these hot, nice because it's not a normal gal. It's pretty hot gal. They were just to do the on them. Yeah, man. That's how the world. That's the world we're living in. And it was some. It's like the man them eat curry goat mixed with <laughs> <laughs> oxtail, yeah. mac and cheese. Yeah, it was. It was. It was. It was. It was. Aki and swordfish. Shit. Pie and mash, some Turkish food, yeah, Ethiopian like, food. All let's mix it up and just nyam it with some with a gallon of milk. <laughs> Knowing that they're lactose. lactose. <laughs> <laughs> Knowing that they're lactose. And just say, yeah, come here again. That's crazy to me. The thing is, yeah, I remember having these conversations before. Like, remember, like, we was having, like, what's your price conversations. Do you remember? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, like, um, man was asking, oh, would you let a man do this? And how much would you let for that happen? I, and me personally, but I don't need the money. I don't need mm. to be rich. Yeah. I, no, I don't want money like that. No, I don't need it. Uh, there's no, that like, much. I have zero need for, for to be a millionaire. Yeah. I've, I've lived this long without being a millionaire. I don't need to compromise myself to be a millionaire. I'd do mm. without. Yeah. I'd do without. So mm. when people talk about price, you know, like, would you, and they, and they, some people are crazy with it. Like, I'm not doing that for a million, 10 million. <laughs> Maybe like what? Like what's the difference? What's the difference? You're still gonna have it in your mind that you've done this. Yeah. Like what? Wh- wh- like when you're in the when you're on your own, <laughs> you're looking in the mirror. Because everybody has that reflection. When you're, on, when you're putting on everybody your, has that reflection. I don't care what you want to who you want to think. Crazy. You are. Everybody gets that reflection. You, look you at know yourself. yourself. Think. Listen, I'm a piece of shit. Yeah, you can hide from the world, but you can't hide, you from, can't yourself. hide from yourself. You can't. There's no, you can't it's hide in, from man, but you, not your conscience. You can't You're looking at yourself, thinking you can't run it. I'm off key. I'm off key. I've sold myself. You're, you're everything from there. From me leave your yard, everything's a front. You know that, isn't it? 
Yeah, your happiness, how yeah. you feel. Yeah, yeah, it's all fake. Everything's fake. No, there has to be a there has to be a level where you you can say, you know what, bro, I'm okay. I just don't need it. Yeah. I just don't need it. Yeah, bro. Like, if if I never become a millionaire, I'm okay because mm-hmm. I know people that have lived from up till 80, 90, never become a millionaire, and their life was good. They did okay. Yeah. So you don't have. That's not the only way to go. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? It's crazy. But that's no, but remember that's the world we're living in now. People compromising them. So keep your integrity, man. Listen, always be able to keep your head held high and say, "Boy, I never folded." Yeah. Yeah, yeah. no, nah, that's mad to me. A lot of that shit's mad to me, bro. I'll tell you, crazy. Um, but I'm saying all that, I know you got a price. Cause you're quite materialistic. So I know you got a price on a lot of things, and it's not a bad thing because we're different people. But you I like the way you said it when I say straight face. You've got a price. I don't have any. You price. got a price. Look, a man come with now and say, "Look, no I, I could, I could no download man. you every stream, you every music." <laughs> we say I won't do it for money, but you do it for songs. You do it for songs. Yeah, a man yeah. said I give you every streaming thing, network. Uh, yeah. I give you a really? plate on every every tune, <laughs> and you'll be yeah. like, "Whoa!" <laughs> in the class saying, "You know what? My gold tune to be able to play them tune." Yeah, yeah. indirectly <laughs> telling you his business. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you'll do it for a couple grand. Oh, I mean, I like a couple that, grand, a couple grand. This was a couple grand. Then he start promising you. The moment you start seeing promising patrons, yo, <laughs> listen, I'm taking out a hundred of you. Yeah, something's happened. Anyway, this is just big compromise. All right, we're gonna start. All right, we're in patron territory, and I'm just about to start the thing about Chris Carver's death. Oh, what's rest your take peace, on rest it? Rest in peace, man. Rest in peace, Chris Carver. Hey. Yo, people, listen, make sure you check out us on Patreon. That's www.patreon.com forward slash elephant in the room. Make sure you sign up. It's only three pounds a month. You get to watch the full episode. All right. Because you can see we've just cut the episode short in it. So if you want to watch the full episode, jump onto Patreon. You're also going to get some exclusive content over there. You're also going to be the first dips on anything that we're doing. You're going to be the first person or the first set of people that can get tickets and they're going to have the opportunities. All right, so jump over to Patreon and make sure you follow us and you keep it elephant in the room, all right? So join us over on Patreon and peace. <laughs>